Okay, guys, this is Spacious Place 2.0, okay? Part 2 from the uh, other video. I'm going to put them back-to-back -back on here so y'all will know it's back-to-back. -back. I'll put it on the title, too. The Most High wants us to start imagining things as though they already were, like Scripture states. And while you're doing such, get into the feeling of what you're saying. He wants you to say, like he gave me the example, which I've been doing this. Uh, this is how I got to the state that I'm in now. It's basically manifesting, which is the same thing the Most High did to create the heavens and the earth and us. Father, I love my new house. I love my new kitchen. I love, he said, go into detail. He loves detail. What you pray for and you are trusting him to give you, he has already given you in the spirit realm. Now he wants you to speak it into existence so it can pull it on down to earth, okay? So be very specific. Even if you got the right stuff down and hold on, he's giving me this make it plain write the vision down make it plain right so he wants me to read it for those that aren't familiar it's habakkuk chapter 2 verses 2 through 3 it says and the lord answered me and said write the vision and make it plain upon tap tables this version says tables another one says tablets write it down on paper okay <laughs> that he may run that readeth it if you don't have your vision on paper where you can actually understand and read it, how are you going to run in that? What, what he's saying is to run in that direction towards the goal. Run towards the goal. For the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it may tarry, wait for it because it will surely come to pass. But back to, I just wanted to finish out the scripture, but write the vision down that's that was first instruction then make it plain now when you're making it plain you're not only making it plain to you you're making it plain to the most high that you understand what the what the goal is, is he already put the desire in you so he already knows what the vision is he's seen everything from beginning to end before we were even born okay but now he wants us to see it and make it plain to ourselves and when you write it down he will give you other things to add to it okay the most high is amazing and then you can run on it that's your goal that's your goal plan that's why a lot of people do vision boards people that are very successful have vision boards and i'm when i tell y'all vision boards is where it's at do a vision board that way you can it's in front of you and you can see what you have desires for okay but he wants you to do this. He wants you to really go into detail. I love my new whatever. Whatever you pray for and are trusting him to uh, bless you with, that's what you need to be speaking into existence, guys. Because he is so adamant about it. I did another video about it. And every time he tells me to do a video about it, I'm going to do a video about it. So until y'all do it and he sees y'all doing it, I guess I'll be doing videos <laughs> until. But get into it because it is beneficial and it actually works. Just like you can speak negativity over your day, over your life or whatever, you speak positivity over it as well. So make sure that you are doing what you need to do, okay? And for those of you that did not see part one, please go back and see part one of this video because you can get through with this one, but they go together. And then y'all will know that I, I was letting y'all know why my hair look a hot mess. I look like Sonic the Hedgehog. But anyway... <laughs> But at the end of the day, that's the word. Until next time, guys, peace and blessings.